Tia Delft Solar Boat Team builds one solar powered boat every year. We want to show what's possible with the current technologies when you push it to its boundaries. We've shown that we can reach up to 55 km an hour purely on solar energy. Our team tries to improve on previously used technologies every year. The biggest improvement yet was using hydrofoils to fly above the water to reduce the water resistance to a minimum. This way, with the same energy, we can achieve a lot more. This year, we have a team of 26 students from TU Delft. It is a multidisciplinary team, which means that good communication is essential for a good workflow. Although our project is going top speed, quality is our strength. Every part of the boat needs to work optimally in order to win our international race competition. This way, we can show the world what is possible with just a little bit of sustainable energy. It's a great platform to inspire people. Our year is divided into several phases. These are the design, projection and testing phase. During the design phase, every part of the boat is designed to the very last detail. All parts must then be produced and assembled into one boat during the production and testing phase. In this process, good communication is of great importance. 3D mapping, also called virtual reality, helps with visualizing our design. This is a good way to communicate our design to our partners as well as fellow engineers. After designing, everything we put on paper has to be produced. The production phase is a really quick phase. With help from our partners, we can reach the highest quality possible. By the time the boat is finished, a lot of work needs to be done before it can actually sail on races. During the period between production and racing, the boat needs to be tested and optimized. Furthermore, the pilot has time to train for the races. It is of great importance that the test phase is not underestimated. It can be the difference between winning or losing. By pushing our design to a higher level every year, we want to accelerate the transition to a more sustainable world.